So where are we now? We're after night session when Nathan's mum, uh, wife and child died and before the party. Good night, princess. Is Nathan okay? When will I see him again? Oh, I don't know, honey. He hasn't left his office in three days. He loved his wife and daughter more than anything in the world. But we can try again tomorrow, okay? Now you get some sleep. Maybe after I complete the game, I'll be able to go back and find that, that choice. Maybe. Oh, is there no one here? That's unusual. I guess Nathan's still boring about his wife. Uh, this is his office. This is where I get interviewed. Tony. What are you doing here? It's late. Go back to bed. It was so quick. Mommy couldn't do anything. But it didn't hurt. Stop it, Jody. It didn't hurt at all. You hear me? Stop it right now. We are here, Nathan. We're right by your side. How about Laura? We love you, darling. We'll always love you. Talk to me again. Jody. Make them come back. Make them come back again! I can't. They've gone. Please. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. I missed them so much.
So this must be right at the end then. Black Sun, after we got back from the uh, tundra. The active condenser in the Republic of Kazakhstan has been destroyed and the rift is now inaccessible. We are now the only nation with access to the infoworld. This situation opens up new strategic and military perspectives. And we're going to launch new programs to discover possible energy resources and develop military applications. We've already found ways of linking entities to human soldiers, and this is just the beginning. Now, this is more important than the race to space for developing nuclear capability. We have discovered a new world. A world for us to conquer. This is the beginning of a new era for our nation. God bless America. I hope he's not waiting to try and ambush me. Can I whack? Is that the guy that's in charge? Let's whack him. I don't think it is. Pentagon top brass getting you down? Ugh, big boys and their new toys. I preferred to leave before barfing all over their carpet. We played our part in all of this. They told us we were doing the right thing. But all we did was allow the Pentagon alone to control the infraworld. What are you going to do now? I want to... Leave. Go somewhere far away and... just try and lead a normal life. <sighs> and what about you? CIA has it all mapped out for me. Top tier, big car, golf meetings. I, mean, I haven't given them an answer yet, but it's worth considering. Listen, Jody, I, I know it's been complicated between us, and I, and I didn't always do the right thing. But maybe we could start again, you know, try and build something together. I mean, after all the stuff we've been through, maybe we could make it work. Stop being so fucking pushy. You lied to me. I could never trust you again. I'm sorry, Ryan. No, I understand. Well, look, whatever you do, just remember I'll always be there for you. Ah, there you are. Nathan's looking for you. Come on, I'll take you to his office. Later, Ryan. Oh, you know what? I got a single malt in my office that needs sharing. Meet you in a few? No, I, I don't think I... Come on. Don't make me drink it alone. Waste of a good bottle? I'll tell you what, I'll find you, okay? <laughs> this way, Jody. I'd rather go back to the ranch. At least they weren't massive dicks. Some decisions are hard to make, huh, Jody? I just hope I make the right one. Just do what your heart tells you. And you know you made the right decision. So should I kill Nathan? I don't think I should kill Cole. I don't think he has enough power to be responsible for a lot of this. It's Nathan. And 
Ryan. Alright, here we are. Call me when you're done, I'll come pick you up. Okay. Whatever Nathan says, be careful. Yeah, the CIA is not going to let me walk away. Come in! Oh, I should have spied on him, probably. Right, I can't kill him yet. Jody. Oh, I'm so glad to see you safe. I kept my part of the bargain. Now it's the CIA's turn. As far as the CIA is concerned, you no longer exist. Elizabeth North, a new identity and new life. Five hundred thousand dollars for services rendered. That should help make a new start. Thanks. Before you go, there's one last thing I'd like to ask. When my wife and daughter disappeared in that accident 15 years ago, I wanted to die too. I cried a lot, hanging my head against the wall trying to figure out why, why, why them? Never being able to hold them again. It was like a wound that wouldn't heal. But then you came along. And I realized they were still here all the time, near me. I just couldn't see. me everything I needed to study the infraworld. They were interested in military applications. I was interested in seeing my family again. It's taken me some years, but I finally succeeded in creating this. This is a terrible idea, you idiot. Hello, my darlings. That's healthy. Soon we'll be together. I'm working on a modified condenser that can communicate with the souls of the infraworld. Speaking with the dead Jody, can you imagine? What do you want from me? I want you to help me talk to them. I want to hear their voices. I want to tell them what I'm doing. Until I finish my research, you're the only one that can do it. Nathan. No. 
Don't, don't ask me that. I haven't heard their voices for 15 years. Since that day, I heard them through a little girl. You. I'm begging you. Jody, do this for me. Give me your hands. No, just kill him. Right, I'm not going to do it. Right, how do I trash the machine? This is a terrible, terrible idea. I'm not, I'm not getting involved. Right, how do I smash the computer? Come on. This is this isn't good. Okay, I don't trash it there. to wait for. I'm not going to do it. I'm very impatient. I'm quite an impatient person. How much longer do we have to wait? I'm not going to do it. So no, I'm not doing it. It's not going to let me move on, is it? I think it'll be the end game soon. I'll, I'll talk about it then. You did. You keeping them here. They're being torn apart between two roles. That's not true. You're lying. I know they want to be with me again. I know they want to be with me. You wanted to talk to them. Okay? You heard what they had to say. Goodbye, Nathan. Good idea, that.
Well, that was a surprise. Hi, Dorothy. Good, Good to, to see you again. again. Well, you put us in a very difficult situation, you know that. We can't let you go. We can't kill you either. I don't know what you'll do on the other side. So there's only one appropriate solution. We inject you with a neuro acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your mother. A simple and elegant way to put an end to our uh, collaboration. Goodbye, Julie. We will always be grateful for your help. Separated again. What are you? What are you talking about? The containment field. I'm going to deactivate it. The infraworld will spread through our dimension. Life and death united in one world. It's not just souls on the other side. It's death. I've beaten death, Jody. Everything's gonna be just fine. You need to trust me. Everything's gonna turn out fine. I figured I might at least be able to throttle him. I uh, see, there we go. You're too weak, Aiden. Find something else. Get help. Hurry. Where's the rest of your team? Vince and Nick? <laughs> they have three months leave. They're on a beach on some exotic island, no doubt. Lucky bastards. Hey, I've got a couple of emails I need to send. You mind if I do that before we crack the bottle? No problem. You two are so fucking dumb. You're as dumb as fucking Nathan. He's fucking dumb. Cole here. Hello? Hello? Oh my god, these two are retarded. You keep entities in this lab? Good God, no. They're all trapped behind the containment field. Aiden? Is that you, Aiden? If this is a joke, it's not funny. Why would Aiden be here? 
What is it, Aiden? Where's Jody? Lead us to Jody, Aiden. Show us the way. Right. Now where? This way. Over there. Okay, I get it. Now I generally, where am I? Going left. You want us to take the elevator? Is that it? Freeman, I have level three authorization. He's with me. Mm, I'm sorry, Mr. Freeman. You do not have the correct authorization for this level. Maybe you could make an exception. I just want to show him. Sorry, sir. This area is level four classified. You do not have the right credentials. You gotta get us past him, Aiden. Desk 42, hello. Hello? Hello? I think you made a mistake. Could you check again, please? Cole Freeman and Ryan Clayton? I'm sorry, you are on the list. My apologies. Um, go on through. Thank you. Hurry, Aiden. Take us to Jody. Can I target it? I uh, will target this one. See if they notice this one. There. Did they notice that? Jody's here. Jody! Get there! Get there! Oh! Nathan! He's gonna deactivate the containment field. What? Why? Why would he do that? He's gone insane. He thinks he's gonna get his family back. We gotta stop him. Containment field. Oh Christ, he's done it. He's done it. You need help? No. No, I'm okay. okay. On that bombshell. Thank you for watching. Come back for the next part of Beyond Two Souls.